Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and also welcome if you're here. So today we're actually here at the Atlanta Premium Outlets here at Vineland and I'm going to show you how busy it is. Like it is slam packed over here on the way over here on Vineland coming from uh, like, um, the Disney Springs areas that way. Like cars are parked along the side of the road and like it's impossible to find a spot. Like it's slam packed and uh, luckily I actually got the spot across the street which is still the premium outlets over here by Ford's garage. So I had to walk across the street then enter the actual outlets itself and just see what's happened over there and some people probably want to stay out and I was thinking I was like I'm probably not going to do this like a long time ago but I was like I'm actually kind of interested to see how the outlets are during the holidays and it's also been a while since I've been here so we're going to check it out and see what's going on so anyways come along with me all right now I'm making a journey across and that is a beautiful sunset by Ford's Garage also a really great place to eat now I have not ate at this location I've only ate the location at a more agreeable resort area but I'm sure it's actually really great here as well but let's get on walking across the street as you can see over here people parked on the side on the grass here as well and it's a what it's gonna be a busy one still but a beautiful day though and we now arrive safely across the street here at the actual Vineland outlets I do like this over here it's kind of cool it changes colors really nice and also, still, I do not know what I'm getting into, <laughs> but it's going to be fun. Okay, so let's actually now head on into the outlet, see what's going on over here, see what kind of deals I can show y'all, and also, of course, the crowd levels inside the actual outlet itself. Okay, first off, showing y'all these two stores that did some big old lines. More specifically, this Goosey store. I don't really care for any of the products, but some people really like them. But a decent sized line right there to get in. And also, not sure about the capacity because COVID is done with, but like, probably still a popular store. And also, beside me is this Tory Burke store. Not sure what kind of store it is, but like, looks like it has some like purses, glasses, different kind of accessories, items. So right now, a big goal focus for this video is to show you all like, the most popular stores, the big old lines. So if you are expecting to go to these stores, you can kind of get an idea how it's going to be. So this is actually a Polo Ralph Lauren children's store, entire store, all apparel, 40% off. Pretty good deal for Polo Ralph Lauren, to be honest. And this is the Vinland Vines. I actually don't have any of these. I mean, it's a kind of a decent brand. I just don't have anything. And looks like it says up to 60% off everything. Pretty good deal. Okay, now pass by the Polo Ralph Lauren store itself. This is actually as well 40% off. This is actually a pretty good deal. But this is a exclusions apply. See associate for details. But still 40% off Polo. Not bad. So I just walked inside real quick to show you all this deal. So 40% off and we'll see the actual price of a Polo itself. $110 for a Polo. So take 40% off of that. Still a decent savings if you do like the Polo brand itself. So just do the math, it would be about $66 instead of $110 for one of these shirts. And I expected really expensive stuff in there, but 40% off does help a little bit if you do like the Polo brand. But next up was actually go into the Nike store. I know this is going to be a big one. A lot of people over here. All right, what's going on? And oh, and also there is the moon in the distance. Look at really nice night, clear skies. Beautiful. And getting a quick peek how to, it looks like inside of here. Very busy, especially checking out. Now checking this wall over here. I guess it's like the clearance wall. And it has additional 30% off entire wall. And it goes to give a little example thing of here, of like what it is. So $19.99 to $13.99. And it goes down. So pretty cool that they do that. Nat over here towards the back, seeing what's going on over here. A lot of 20% off and 30% offs, and this is actually where the line ends to check out. That's unbelievable. It goes all the way up there. Okay, so that was very hard to navigate through the Nike store. Very popular here at the Vina Outlets, especially during the holidays. Okay, we're now made our way down to the Disney Character Warehouse. It's actually been a good couple months since I've actually been here and checked out what's new inside of here. Okay, coming on inside of here, we have some 53 anniversary ornament sets. That's pretty awesome. And we just had some Fairy Droid accessory. Look at that. $15 originally, $70. It's pretty cool. Let's see what else we can find. 
And over here we do have some spirit jerseys. Let's actually see what they have. There's like some from Up right here. Yep, that's from Up. And oh, look at that. Food and Wine Festival. We just had this. Like, it's pretty awesome how they actually have this. Let's actually see how much it is if I get my hands on it. $25. So this thing is like $80 brand new. So if you are one this, might as well wait till it comes out here. We also have plenty of these 50th anniversary ones. Check that out. It's pretty cool. I still like the 50th anniversary. It's pretty awesome. More food and wine festival kind of stuff. It's pretty cool. And what's this one right here? Regular like Magic Kingdom kind of deal. Walt Disney World. It's a pretty cool. And comes this well. We actually have some Mickey's Not So Scary merch nice from this year. Like look at that. You actually get a pillow. That's actually kind of nice pillow. How much is it? it says 40 on it but like it's probably this kind of way cheaper than that i bet but so pretty cool to see that this is a little countdown clock that's actually pretty awesome oh it's 13 dollars originally 40 dollars pretty good deal here's some plushes over here pretty awesome it's a little haunted mansion gargoyle little statue thing it's pretty cool stuff right here time all right, time to look at all the shirts, see what they have over here. They have a whole bunch of these Mighty Thor figures, like they're $16. They have way too much in them. But let's see what they have over here. Some cruise shirt right here, and Disney Wish. Hmm, pretty cool. Let's see how much it is. Let's see, it doesn't, okay, it is $15 originally, 30, so half off that. More Disney Cruise Line, Castaway K. It's pretty cool, that's here. Pretty nifty stuff. There's some pretty cool Disney Cruise Line stuff and also have some Epcot shirts. It's actually like a, some kind of button up. I'm not really a fan of it to be honest, but it's cool to see here. I will say that again, Walt Disney Studios. Hmm, that's pretty cool. I'm honestly really not seeing anything like eye appealing and like, honestly, it's probably why I did not sell in actual stores. Okay, so that was a character warehouse here in Vineland. Just much as I thought, like really not much updated. Only thing I really saw was like not so scary stuff, but other than that, nothing here. Okay, now it's time to head on towards the other stores. And not sure what other kind of stores are down here. I do see some lines. This is True Religion brand jeans. We also have this Boss store. I don't even think I've heard of that. Okay, so this got back over here. Basically, this made a whole circle. I actually came in probably over here by the Goosey store. Made my way all the way around and actually wanted to carry a warehouse. And this kind of looks stores. It's actually like not that bad. Like there is a lot of people here as well. Definitely not like your normal times. But the biggest like I was seeing like in actual stores is probably the Nike store and also this Goosey store again. I don't know anything about the Goosey stuff, but other than like the big line, so it is popular. Okay, so what came in was actually right over here. There's a Goosey store, but I actually forgot about this section over here. So we're gonna check it out as well. You do have like a Lids, a Claire's store. And let's see what this is right here. You got a Children's Play store, and also there's a Lululemon store. Over here is the Air Apostle store. I actually forgot about Air Apostle. I used to wear that in middle school. <laughs> but it actually has some good deals over here. It looks like, um, let's see, everything 50% off to 70% off. Pretty good deal. And all jeans $25 in store. It's actually a pretty good deal. Jeans are kind of pricey these days. And right across the Air Apostle, you have a Converse store. And it says slick styles 50% off. But that's, to me, it sounds like it's like very select few that like don't really sell. That's just my personal opinion. So across the uh, Converse store, you have an Oakley's vault, and also you have your Vans outlet store. And this says 50% off sale shoe when you buy any other shoe. So basically buy one, get one, 50% off those kind of deals. It is a good deal if you are buying more than one pair. Just looking inside, this has some t-shirts, two for 25. Not a bad deal. Okay, so I think I've reached my end here at the premium outlets because I keep going down this way. They're going to the food court, also the character warehouse over there. All right, guys, that's going to be from the Orlando Violin Premium Outlets. Also, it's a really nice view. And as you leave, it's only about 6 o'clock and it's only getting worse over here. Wow. This gives you all an idea. All right, just made my way back across and check out Ford's Garage. That looks really awesome. Really nice for the holidays. 
Okay guys, that will do it here for the learning print arts here at Vineland. Now again, this is just a video for me showing y'all the crowd levels, the stuff going on in the stores, and the kind of deals I could find. And for the more majority, this is me showing y'all the crowd levels. Like I think it's like really important and people like to see the crowd levels, how busy it's going to be in the holidays. And like it really wasn't that bad for some of the stores. You know, of course, some of the stores like the Nike stores, Under Armour, um, the Levi store I walked by was decent, and um, the Goosey store, like some of those big brand stores had a lot of people in and like the polo store that that was pretty wild like i even i showed you a little clip of the, uh, the actual polos itself like there's like a lot of different kind of rooms and it's like really a tight store and like there's a lot of people in there but um just an example of a one to show you different kind of stuff what to expect if you are coming here for the holidays or anytime around that time period like even if you are coming after christmas um i think it's still be kind of busy everyone's gonna be spending their money i've got christmas money to get or gift cards so i think it's still be real busy even after the um, new year's here at the uh, outlets if you are just to make an idea of how it's gonna be but anyways if you did enjoy this video make sure a big old thumbs up and also scratch up for more future content i will see you guys next one thank you so much for watching